I have some very valuable information on floaters and how to get rid of floaters. The most important thing you need to understand about floaters is what are floaters in the first place, okay? Like you have these little worm-like things floating in your eyes that really probably are irritating you. Some of you have them and you got used to them so it doesn't bother you. What is a floater for real? Is it just some broken collagen protein that just kind of floating around? And it's basically this. You have this accumulation of this collagen fiber in a certain form that is damaged from, and I'm going to give you a new word here, it's been glycated. What does that mean? It means that it's stuck to a sugar molecule. So when you connect a protein to a sugar or a sugar to a fat, it gets stuck. Now that protein becomes unavailable and it kind of clogs up the body. Well, that's what these eye floaters are. The official name is Advanced Glycation End Products. Just picture um, you're in an ocean and you see this jellyfish, right? And it's floating along and you can kind of see right through it because it's translucent. And this jellyfish happens to be eating all these little sugary treats, right? And all the sugar is kind of like binding with the this gel, okay, in this jellyfish. And it's making these little worm-like structures which are basically the connection of that collagen to that sugar. So it makes it cloudy. In the eye, you have this it's called vitreous gel, which is basically a translucent, you can see through it, a protein of collagen. And so when you lose your protective mechanism, which are antioxidants, this glycation starts to occur, especially if you're on a high carb diet. Now, here's a question. Is there anything that can get rid of this, okay? And the answer is yes. There are many things that you can do or take that are considered anti-glycation. In other words, they prevent this binding of the sugar to the protein. One reference that I found is called the PDR. Now, it's not in the current versions. It's in the older versions. They have a natural remedy for eye floaters. And all three of these remedies create an anti-glycation effect. So that would be choline, inositol, and methionine. So you would take choline in 1,000 milligrams per day. That's one gram. You would take inositol 500 milligrams each day. And then with methionine, you would only need 200 milligrams. So that is the ratio that was advised years ago in the physician's desk reference. Now, I found a lot of other research on this topic that you can also add to this mixture. One being L-lysine, which is another amino acid that's been very, very promising in creating significant improvement in eye floaters. And I would add one to three grams, depending how bad your floaters are. And this mixture, I would recommend to take on an empty stomach, because that way it won't interfere with other proteins. If you then add intermittent fasting, and maybe even some prolonged fasting to this protocol, I think it would greatly speed it up. But I will say that this remedy does take a bit of time. It takes some months for it to work. But with the fasting, I think you'll see some results within weeks. The other advice I'm going to recommend is to start to cut down your sugar. Okay, I'm talking about going on a low-carb diet. And the name for that is the ketogenic diet. So you'd want to add that as well. Because if you take a look at a diabetic, usually has higher amounts of sugar, they have much greater incidence of having these floaters than a non-diabetic. And when you do keto, you want to do the healthy version of keto because of the antioxidants. We want more antioxidants. So vegetables with high vitamin C would be very helpful. Also meats and seafood that are loaded with zinc. Zinc can also help give you an anti-glycation effect. Now, because of the censoring and the suppressing of the algorithms on YouTube, it's becoming more difficult to find my content. And there's a lot of content that I cannot put on YouTube, unfortunately. So to make sure you have full access of all my information, go to drberg.com and subscribe to my newsletter by clicking the link down below in the description. I will see you on the other side. Now, since we're talking about your eyes, there's some very interesting information about eyes in this video that I think you'll really enjoy right here.